What's up, Twisties? It's Twisted Pandora, and welcome, one and all, to the sixth annual Bloxies 2019 event inside of Roblox with your cyborg host and, of course, his trusty sidekick, Mr. Bob and Cybird. Right now, I do not have face cam on because I'm on a trip, and this very same trip to Japan has made me really sick. So, bear with me while I may sound really sick, and there's no face cam, but we gotta do what we gotta do. We gotta complete this event, and if you guys are super excited, for this event then be sure to drop that like down below subscribe if you guys are new to the channel and let's just hop right into what this is all about welcome one and all to the prestigious ceremony honoring the best developers artists storytellers creators and communities of roblox from february 12th through february 26th come celebrate the festivities with your friends and fellow robloxians discover hidden easter eggs and play through a host of exciting new mini games to earn exclusive virtual items as you can see there are a few mini games that we have to do to earn ourselves three prizes the glasses you'll get from completing the revenge of the bacon mini game where after a century long slumber the enraged bacon kid has returned to exact his vengeance upon robloxia for sealing him and his minions away it's up to you to stop him test your skills by evading an endless barrage of projectiles in this classic arcade shooter now next up is the scavenger hunt this one unlocks the bow tie and this one isn't a really a mini game it's more of finding 12 hidden objects throughout the entire Bloxy Theater map. Also, apparently there are two Easter eggs inside this game for two bonus rewards, which we'll get to in just a second. But for right now, let's move on to guest defense, giving us the wings. And it says here that an unrelenting army of guests is preparing to storm the gates of Castle Robloxia. We need elite warriors like yourself to defend against the invasion before our stronghold is completely overrun. So you can join up to three friends in an epic battle and try to survive for as long as you can. Now, why don't we go into where it actually all takes place in find out oh wait yes right there on the about you may notice there are the three diys from the three missions but also a tuxedo cat and a red carpet cape now to find out what exactly we have to do let's see bacon destroyer okay that we know that guest invasion we know that scavenger hunt we know that but there are two others gnome and meet the developers there's gonna be a gnome in there maybe he comes up and he's like we've been gnomed or something like that that means old but i i don't know that's the best i got going on here and then also meet the developers which probably is the hardest one to get. Hopefully we can find one today, but if we don't, you guys know already that one of the bonus items will be given to you once you meet the developers. Now enough talking, and let's just jump right into the sixth annual Biloxi's Theater. Welcome one and all. It's looking beautiful, and fun fact, as soon as I joined the game, I got the meet developers badge, and as well as the tuxedo cat with it, which makes no sense, because as you guys can see, there is no developer in here, so what I think happened happens is that as long as someone else has met the developer and then they meet you i think you still get the badge that kind of happened back during the egg hunt so that may be a thing right now i'm not too sure but i do think that's the case we already unlocked one of the secret badges right off the start so i think it's time to show you where to go for the second secret badge so just follow this path right now you have to get out and about there's a sewer over here you see that guy's going down right there is where we gotta go so let's go Whoa, hello? Okay, now we're here. Hello, everyone. How's how's everyone doing today? You're doing fantastic because we're about to unlock the second secret. It's somewhere in here, and I know it. You know why I know it? Because I was told by a fan. Huge shout out to uh, these guys that are following right now. They're pretty much telling me all the secrets, so this helps out a lot. But anyways, guys, as you see here, we actually were correct. There is the gnome, and we got the gnome award and the red carpet cape. It looks exactly like this one that AJ Sasa one is wearing. Once you're done with that, you can go ahead and head on back out through the sewer so now that we got the secret badges out of the way let's move on to the hardest badge which is in my opinion the scavenger hunt where you have to find 11 total items inside this map so we're gonna go ahead and reset so we start from the beginning so that when you guys start from the beginning you know exactly where to go i just want you guys to follow me this entire time nothing in the beginning but as soon as you get here turn to the right there's gonna be a few items i know it. i know it it's coming here and yes if we can zoom out not the 
the tickets, but there's a guy right over. What is this? What? Wait, what is that? Let's go to him. I found Pizza Boy! Wow, you can barely see him because of all the fans. Again, shout out to the massive amount of fans here. You guys are awesome. But here is the second item right over here, which is the Bloxy Statue Base. Now, what you're going to want to do is go across to the left side because over here there are two other items. The first one is the Apple Basket to make it a total of three items. And then we're going to head over down here into the sewage like we did earlier because you may have noticed there is actually a golf cart we passed it in the sewers there it is right there now that's it for the four items that are available here the rest of them are inside the theater so head back through the sewer and head into one of the two entrances it doesn't matter as long as you go in and enter you should be good all right now that you're in here you're gonna notice right here is a house you just walk up to it and boom you find a small house super easy it's on the left side of the entrance now let's go down into the arcade because here are a few others. You don't want to go down into the dance floor because on this little table is a Bloxy statue head. Now what you're going to want to do is head back out this way, but instead of going up the stairs right now, you're going to want to go into the washroom over here to get the next item, which is chilling inside this stall. So it can be a bit tricky, but there we have, we found Xander. That should bring us to a total of seven items, meaning that there's only four more to collect. Now for the next four, you're going to want to enter the theater itself. It will teleport you to another place. So that's kind of exciting. I didn't even know that. Loading to the Bloxies. Okay, uh, hello, and click here to enter. Okay, there we go, and now we're gonna head down into the theater itself, but before we go anywhere near the front, I'm gonna have to go over to the right side, because you may notice way over in the right side, one of the tables is holding a secret wing. Now, I gotta find it, because I don't know where, there it is. Right over here is one of the wings. This one is the right side. And now we're gonna have to find the left wing, which is super easy, because you gotta go up on the stage, and behind the Bloxy statue itself is the left wing for the Bloxy statue. There are only two left, and to get there, all you have to do is get to the second floor. Ah, ha, ha. There's a door right there waiting for us. So let's go into the second level, and that should bring us there. Hello? Oh, it does a whole, like, little mini cutscene. Ah, there you are. I found ya. I found ya. The actual Bloxy statue itself was there all along. Wait, guys. I said there were four items inside the actual theater part, but I was wrong. I'm sorry, guys. I thought there would be there, but I made a mistake. The final 11th item is actually... Pretty simple to find. You just got to go up the stairs in the normal area. And right over here is like a cup. I don't really know what that is. Oh, it's an Astro Egg Chair. And as you guys can see, we got the True Scavenger Award and the DIY Cardboard Bow Tie. Now that brings us to a total of three out of the five missions completed today. So let's move on to the final two where you're going to have to go into the arcade to unlock them. Now to unlock both of them, you guys already know, we have to play two separate arcade games. One of them is known as Shmup and one of them is known as Guest Invaders. So uh, why don't we start off with the leftmost one, Mr. Shmup himself. Press Z to play. All right, so let's start the first of two mini games inside of the Bloxy Theaters. We gotta press the arrow keys to move and Z to shoot. Okay, so we can just, oh, we can just literally hold down. Oh, that's perfect. Oh my gosh, this is super easy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, okay, so he's shooting a lot. He's shooting a lot. Okay, okay, well, all of these guys are shooting a lot, and this is only phase one? Oh, jeez, Lise, this is crazy. This is absolutely crazy. Oh, my goodness. Okay, pro tip here, guys. We just went to phase two, but that's not the pro tip. What I wanted to say is that I think you should focus on more about dodging the beams, so looking at your character and seeing where he is so you're able to dodge the beams rather than looking at the Bacon Man just to try to shoot him because, oh, I walked into that one, so now I have four lives left, but... I think your life is much more valuable than focusing on the Bacon Man. And by the way, you can probably just go back to the Bacon Man and you can look at him in through your peripherals. What really? What? Oh, come on. That did not hit me. Anyways, now I have three lives left. Oh, whoa, whoa. You're, you're, you're really getting fast here with your show. Oh, my goodness. That's a lot. You know what? I'm going to go over to this corner. Wow. That was super. Ah, dang it. What's with these super close shots? You know, Mr. Bacon Man, I don't know if I appreciate I don't appreciate them. You know what? I don't. I don't at all. But I'm going to go over here so I can dodge these all. Now back. Now I'm back in action. He's going to shoot another few. He's going to shoot another few. Yep, there we go. And now he's going to shoot these off. 
There we go, there we go. Oh, haha! You weren't expecting that little Roblox little logo thing. I don't even know what you are, but you're gonna go to the next stage. Two lives left on stage four out of five. You know what? This one, this one doesn't seem too. Oh my goodness! Wow, wow. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. I have two lives. I don't want to lose them though. We gotta make it to stage five. We gotta make it to stage five. Oh! Gosh, there's so many little balls trying to come after me. Orange, green, and red all at the same time. Okay, dodge those. And here comes the red ones. Oh, I can just stay still because, wow, that, why, I feel like, st oh, okay, okay. Now they're coming from around me. Oh, gosh. Oh, my goodness gracious. Wow, wow, wow. How am I doing this? I may only have two lives left, but I'm still kicking, Baker Man. You can't take me out. Come on, come on. Yes, we did it. We got the Bacon Destroyer Award and the DIY Golden Block C Shades. Take that, Mr. Bacon. That is one minigame down, and now it's time for Guest Invaders. 20 seconds until the quest starts. Oh, Sorcerer or Warrior. I think I kind of want to be a warrior. So let's go be a warrior with Mr. Dogman while Galaxy Nova and Emmanuel are the sorcerers. Now this one is like the Atlantis event and other events before it where you can do it with other people. So hopefully this will be a walk in the park for the final batch. All right, so we have two options here. We can either aim and attacking by left clicking. So we have sorcerers and I am the warrior here. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I just got bombed. Oh my gosh, classic guest. Super OP, but as you guys can see, we only need to kill one more guest, and then we go to the next wave, just like we did there. Thank you so much, Emmanuel, for zapping them with your sorcerer powers. We have nine more seconds until the next wave comes, and it's super easy. All we gotta do is kill the amount of guests before they get to our house, which is over here. So it's really cool. Now we just gotta aim. Aim it over here and attack. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Wow, wow, the bomb guys. The bomb guys do a bit, but I took the modern guest out. Okay, there we go. Let's take this guy out. Boom. All right, perfect. Modern guest, hey, come over here. Come, come over. Oh, oh, I did a damage, but he got me on that one. But it's okay. We only have two more guests left until we can move on to stage three. One more now, and boom. All right, wave three. Oh my gosh. It, I, I hope that's one of you guys doing that move because uh, if it was one of these guys that, wow. What just happened? How do we take all those guys out? I, I don't know how that was possible. One of you guys use like your ultimate sorcerer moves because that's awesome. But now let's aim and attack. Attack. Attack them all. Die, Mr. Guest. Oh, we just killed two in one. Oh, but now I died. Great. Oh, great. But there's only four left. In the beginning, there was 10 and now there's only one left and he's about to die. He's literally about to die to Galaxy Nova. Boom. ka -chow. There we go. Now we're going to stage Four. And I thought the arcade game from earlier was super fast. This one is even faster. I can imagine how it would take a lot longer if it was just yourself. But wow. Whoa. Personified Mafia. Jeez. I don't know what just happened, but apparently we killed all of them in wave four with just one super hit from one of the OP moves from the sorcerer. So as you guys can see, it's probably a lot better just to be a sorcerer because we just completed wave five. A super. Oh. Whoa, 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 okay, I thought we completed wave five, and I was gonna say we completed it super quick, but it seems like there was, uh, personified mafia coming out right at the end, so we gotta dodge his rockets, but Mr. Sorcerer Emmanuel is gonna take them all out with his ultimate move, wow, that was amazing, guys, we just got that you survived the guest invasion and the DIY golden Bloxy something, I don't know which one, but it's the last one we got, that was super duper easy, what I I recommend honestly is to just be a sorcerer it seems like the knight can only do so much and he dies really quickly a sorcerer can stay behind the knights and the sorcerer just spams his ultimate moves from exploding things to the super op earth raising thing i don't know what it was but it was insane he did so much damage waves four and five they were eliminated so quickly I'm so glad I had an amazing team behind me because now we have unlocked all five badges inside the Bloxy event 2019, meaning that we have all five items. So guys, that will bring us to the end of today's episode on the channel. If you guys enjoyed and if this helped you out, be sure to drop that like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new to the channel and I'll see you all next time in another event video. This is Twisted Pandora signing off and as always, don't forget to stay snazzy.